I am not worthy to have you under my roof. My dear brothers and sisters, welcome to Vajnamardha. Gospel of Luke chapter 7 begins with a striking incident. Here, people asked Jesus to heal the servant of a centurion. This centurion has, he is the central character of this story. And he has got many qualities. He is not an ordinary person. And he is a deeply religious person. And he has got an unusual attitude towards his servant. But the most important qualities are his humility and faith. He was a humble person. He said, I am not worthy to have you under my roof. And he doesn't go personally, he sends somebody else because he thinks that he is not worthy to meet Jesus. And again, his deep faith, he says, he need not come, he just to say a word. He knew the power of Jesus Christ. He knew the supremacy of God. He knew the power of faith. My dear brothers and sisters, these two qualities are very essential for a successful life. If you are a person of humility, if you are a person of deep faith, you will succeed in your life. Humility is very essential in our life, day-to-day -day life, for a peaceful life. Teresa Favela says, we can defeat Lord with humility. Alphonse Maria Liori says, two evil, pride and uh, adultery. Adultery is like uh, smallpox, it is so visible, but uh, pride is like cancer. Outside it will be so beautiful, but it is inside. So, be humble. Humility is essential for the success of our life. Then faith. Be faith in God. There we realize our helplessness. Trust in the God. So this man, Centurion, knew that uh, Jesus could do it. There is nothing impossible for God, for Jesus. And Jesus prays his faith. He said, even in Israel, I have not seen these kinds of people, people with such a faith. So, my dear brothers and sisters, lead a humble life. If you are a person of faith, you should manifest it through your life. Because Word of God says, faith without action is dead. So, it should be manifested, expressed through your life. Let us become a person of humility, a person of deep faith. That is a secret of success in the life. May Almighty God bless you, the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit. Amen.